You want to know how I got these scars? My father was a drinker and a thief. One night, he goes off a bit crazier than usual. Mommy gets the kitchen knife to defend herself. Daddy doesn't like that. Not one bit. So, me watching, he takes the knife from her and says, Why so serious, sir? He turns to me and says, Why so serious? He comes to me, puts the knife in my mouth, and why so serious? Okay, so that was my poor imitation of my Halloween costume. And right now I'm not wearing the full body thing, and my makeup's gonna be pretty much better, but I didn't want to waste the white stuff that I have, so I used like actual like face paint white stuff, like you know the little crayon, <laughs> and just like draw all over my face. Um yeah. Um this video is actually gonna be really short because there's not much to talk about, and I'm making a, like, extra credit thing for Day of the Dead in Spanish tomorrow, since tomorrow's how to be. Um, so yeah. Uh, I'm just gonna kind of do what Jackie and Brandy and mix and do what Jackie did. Yeah, just follow Jackie. Um, so first, I will talk about what I thought of the little trailers that have been released on TV and stuff. Okay, there's that one in particular that Tay put in her trailer with the guy and he's like, they've been living among us and we haven't noticed, blah, 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 blah. And was it just me? But I commented on her video and did anyone else notice when Kristen Stewart and Robert Pattinson were like going at it that she was in her underwear? Uh, I could swear that doesn't happen in this book. I could swear that doesn't happen until breaking dawn so what's going on here I was a little upset about that just because he's barely even like touching her in this book and all of a sudden she has her pants off <sighs> but I do have to agree with Tay a little bit that she's getting better sort of Ew. sorry Jackie but I really just know She's not Bella for me, and it's. I think the main thing is the voice. She sounds deep. Her voice is like deeper than Robert Pattinson's, and that doesn't really work out. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry. And on to the Twilight costumes. Um, so, as for Bella and Edward, they'd probably do one of those little matchy little like pair things that a lot of people do. Like, you know, she's like the ketchup bottle and he's the mustard no, that, yeah. not, not necessarily that like one my face itches and it, I can't scratch it uh, not necessarily that like option but something like that um um Emmett would probably <laughs> I liked the chick magnet idea that's so true um I'm gonna say a bear <laughs> I think Emmett would go as a bear a grizzly bear big grizzly bear um, Esme and Carlisle would probably do another one of those, like, you know, couple-y things. Except, like, you know, he would probably dress up as the doctor and she'd be, like, the patient. I can totally see that, like, in my mind right now. You know, him with, like, that thing on his head. Yeah. Uh. Hmm. Rosalie would probably be some one of those, like, slutty costumes that nobody ever really wants to buy because the skirt is, like non-existent just because it's Rosalie not that I don't completely I kind of like her sort of ish I liked her better in the second book but in the fourth book she really started getting on my nerves about how she was trying to like you know she didn't spoilers for anyone that has not read it but I don't see why if you're watching this video you have not read it um I don't see why she's like you know trying to get Renesme out, so, like, even if Bella dies. I mean, I know she's never really cared for Bella, but still, that's a bit harsh. I'd feel a bit, like, rejected, you know? Like, ouch. I haven't actually really thought about this because I didn't know what our topic was until I watched the videos today, um, so I don't- I'm making these up off the top of my head. So that's pretty much it for those costumes. <laughs> um, yeah, sorry this video kind of sucks. We didn't really- we didn't have a topic this week though, like Randy said, it was just Halloween costumes. We're not actually talking about anything. Not the best idea ever, I'm gonna admit. 
And going along with how I didn't know what our actual theme was, I didn't come up with a challenge for anybody, and I honestly can, like, my mind is totally blanking right now, because I'm, like, in AP world mode, because we just had to write this DQ, but it was also a compare and contrast, and a changes in continuities essay, basically all in one. And it was really hard, and then I had an English essay today on Great Expectations by Charles Dickens. So, I'm not really in creative thinking mode, I'm more in just like, I'm spitting stuff out on the paper. You guys are good enough, whoever I would have picked, you're getting off scot-free this week. No challenge for you. Um, and happy Halloween everybody! So enjoy tomorrow, dead, day of, day of the dead in Spanish, Dia de Muerte. <laughs> I suck at Spanish, I'm not even gonna like try. Um, blah, blah, blah. So yeah. Um, have a happy Halloween, and I just said Halloween. Have a happy Halloween, and see you next Thursday. Bye.